Tell me more about this. This looks really awesome. Hi, well, I'm Camille. I'm from the Riverside Area Rape Crisis Center. I'm an advocate, and we offer support to survivors and families of survivors of sexual assault. So we offer short-term counseling, so that's up to eight free counseling sessions. We have a 24-hour crisis line. We um, accompany survivors to the hospital for the forensic, forensic exam. We can accompany them through the law enforcement interview, and then we can also accompany them through the trial, if it goes to trial. Um, we also do community outreach, so we can come into the schools, churches, any community, and set up a presentation. We even um, have programs for little kids, so we can do uh, talks on good touch, bad touch. We offer self-defense classes for little kids, for grown-ups, we can have uh, female-only or male-only classes. Uh, what else do we do? So much, so much. We have a host of referrals, so we can uh, give out websites, uh, shelters information, transportation, um, just all kinds of support. We're, we're all about supporting survivors of sexual assault. We don't want victims, we want survivors. We, our, our goal is to help the survivor move forward from that moment on. We're not living in the past, we're moving forward. It's a part of who we are, but how can we move forward? And that's what our agency does. We just try to help them move forward in any way possible. That's really cool, and this is located? We are in Riverside, and we okay. service the Riverside area. Um, it's completely free. Okay. That's so good. that's, that's cool. awesome. Yes. <laughs> and also, we're always looking for more volunteers. Okay. We need a lot of advocates. It's crazy the amount of assaults that go on. We get um, about 30 calls a month. So you could say maybe about one per day. Yeah, wow. So we definitely need more volunteers to support people because it's just happening too much. And so if you, like for example, if I'm interested in volunteering, how would I go about that? You, okay, you would just contact the crisis center, call their number, or c go on the website. We offer trainings all throughout the year. It's a 52-hour training. Uh, it's about two times a week for three hours um, at a time up for about eight weeks and once you graduate you get a nice certificate and you have to um, sign up for at least three shifts a month so okay. two advocacy shifts and one hotline shift very cool yes. what a good information i learned yes. thank you definitely take advantage of the volunteering all right that sounds like something i want to do